There's something really special about making art that moves. Whether it's sculpture or fabric or painting, all art is interacting with the body in one way or another. Um, and this is an opportunity for us to see that come to life in a way that you don't see in your closed off studio. Tonight we are putting on our second annual wearable art show. This year it's called Vestments, as named by the students. We have representation from sculpture, glass, there's a visual studies class that's a cosplay class. And then the other class that is in our department that's very much involved is our body art and adornment class. There's some performance pieces, things that are completely absurd, and then things that are sort of more traditional. So it's the whole gamut of what is wearable and what is art. I have six different works um, based off these different magician's illusions that I'm just really enamored with. So I recreated those um, through some woodworking sculpture classes and in my experimental costuming class, I brought them to life as well. One of the works that is going down the runway tonight is this green table based off this illusion um, that I've seen many talented magicians do and I wanted to put it in this different context. I've been calling it flower bed head. I worked with my model to get her to fit into this confined space comfortably and be able to see and perform the act of walking while having the torso completely concealed. It's honestly a lot easier than I was hoping was it did perfect to make the box usable for me and that's great. New media especially and fashion like Lissa is making is something that's on the verge of being really popular and I think that Tyler School of Art is doing a great job at promoting things that are going to be A, sellable and B, consumable in the art world in the future and I think that's a great thing to have. The Fibers Department here has been amazing because they allow a lot of collaboration and Tyler in general is going towards much more of an interdisciplinary route. Being a junior right now, I'm just trying to push my limits and make as much work as possible and figure out ideas on where I want to go for my thesis. So this was a great exercise to be able to do that. It's a wonderful way to end the year. We'll, we'll be doing this now every spring semester. And I mean, they're excited and exhausted, but I think they're also elated to have this opportunity and, and to really show the school what they've been working so hard on.